But first, on this Tuesday morning, we start off with some breaking news after a Valley restaurant went up in flames. Uh, Javier, good morning. Uh, the video really shocking when you see this. These flames were huge. We're talking about a Sizzler restaurant in Mesa. So let's head out to Gibby, who's on scene right now. A really dramatic video. This near Southern and Country Club. Gibby, good morning. Good morning, guys. Yeah, the good news here is that no firefighters are injured and no one was inside this sizzler. And that's partly the reason why they uh, went defensive. Now, when you take a closer look, they're having to hit it with more water right now because the flames started to pop right up in one of the corners of this sizzlers out here. But you could see where the roof collapsed. And that's one of the reasons why uh, the firefighters, anytime you have that style of roof on a building like that, uh, firefighters will go defensive once they know there was there is no one inside the building or there is no harm to anyone there. But you can see they're hit, it's still hitting it with heavy fire, trying to get this uh, fire under control. They have a perimeter set up where they've just been uh, trying to put this fire out, guys. But as you saw earlier this morning, this is what it looked like when crews first got out here to the scene. You can see those flames just shooting up uh, high as they could there in the sky as these Crews quickly started to put water on it. As you mentioned, they were hitting it with a ladder, trying to put it out as fast as possible. Right now, they've got to determine if... Uh, if uh, what was causing this fire here and the reason why is because when there's no one working at this time, uh, is it something where they delivering during the day? Did someone leave an oven on that kind of thing? So uh, these are all questions they're going to have to ask. But according to Mesa Fire, it's still way too early to determine the cause.